Good afternoon, Doug Levi, Strategic Insurance Services, the insurancetrainers.com, insurancesidehustling.com. I want to shoot a video today on one of our favorite subjects here in Florida, and I say that a little uh, sarcastically, which is citizens. So citizens is the state-backed insurer. They're becoming a bigger and bigger part of the market in Florida just due to uh, the nature of what's going on in homeowners here in Florida. And I wanted to shoot a video on how to do a quick quote. So traditionally with citizens, you have to go through what's known as the clearinghouse and to get a proposal takes a lot of questions and having them look at a few other carriers first. Well, if you've been in the market long enough, you'll know what's going to fit for citizens, frankly, because it won't fit anywhere else. We want to show you guys a way to, to get into that pretty easily. So first thing I'm doing here, this is the citizens account center page. And I'm going to just highlight that how I got there you would go in uh, once you've logged into uh, RoboForm if you're part of our team otherwise just your regular citizens login <clears throat> and you get in and you're gonna click into Policy Center okay for sake of time that's what I'm at right here right and then once you're here you would either enter in a new client or if it's someone you've already put in you can enter that in here okay so I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna go new account it's gonna ask me for some basic info and in this case I'd already done an account previously for myself and once I'm in here, you would have to go new submission. And then once you have done a new submission, you're going to have an, op an option of whether doing a full application or a quick quote. This is kind of really the magic here. So you're going to click quick quote. It's going to say it's only available for personal. You're going to select personal lines. Then you're going to go in and you're going to tell it what you want to quote. So you would say multi parallel no one con uh, know that we're not just doing contents only we'll say it's a dwelling we'll say it's homeowners okay and then from here there's going to be a few other questions that the system's going to ask me to do so i'll click next it's going to say it must be submitted through the clearinghouse we do know that but it still will allow me to get a quote okay We'll say no to the no prior surcharge. We've got effective date. The system's just thinking here. And while I'm doing this, or while this system is thinking, well, we've already got bored that. So I'm going to put in the address. So this is my address. Okay. Okay, and then property info, it will be able to retrieve. So it pulled the info directly through from their own databases. We'll click accept. Okay, we'll click next. It's going to ask for coverage. You can click on this cost estimator. Cost estimator will then take you here to this Marshall Swift and Beck. And again, just for sake of time now, you could certainly go in and say custom, updated, this, that, the other. Um, and this is saying it's unusual to have attached garage with pure foundation. So I will go in just for now and update somehow the foundation. And it's definitely not peers. The, let's see here, where foundation. Structure, superstructure, framing, extras. Hmm. Never fun when you're trying to do these videos and show like one thing and you're not quite seeing it. So I'm sure foundation is somewhere that I'm missing. Exterior walls, porches, pools, windows, doors, roof walls, balconies, exterior stud, roof structure, floor structure. I don't know where it's pulling that through from then. See so if we go and edit it in here. Here we go. So we'll say slab on grade. Okay. 
and then we'll say save. So this is just showing how you could update this. And I'll click finish, save, close to return to policy center. Not really should have pulled through by now. <laughs> Gotta love citizens and if it didn't, evaluation isn't as slab between one concrete foundation. Okay, maybe it didn't like because it says foundation materials wood. That's what it didn't like there. Okay. These are good examples of just how s sensitive the system can be. Um, that should work now. And if we go finish, hopefully that potentially updates and pulls through. So Citizens is the one of the largest carriers in the state of Florida. They are now writing over 5,000 policies per month at current time we're in summer 2021 and um yeah a lot going on there so we'll say other structures we'll say personal property typically has to be either 25 percent or 50 percent of coverage a again just for sake of time i'm just going to put it in as 50 percent and then the most liability they'll give is 100000 That's all they'll give. We definitely recommend more liability than that. Traditionally on homeowner's insurance, you want at least um, 300000 or 500000 I'll change the deductible to 2500 I will change here in a minute the hurricane to 2%. And then I will... Go over here and we'll say replacement cost on contents. I do recommend that. It's super important to understand that just very foundationally is what replacement cost means. It means they're not going to depreciate based on how old the item is. They're going to do it cost new, which is what most people want. And then after that, come back up here. We'll click next. And we should be able to get our premium estimate. I don't think there's going to be anything else here well that's going to tell me a few things we said dwelling primary we're going to say none to the burglar alarm sprinkler all that none 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 next if i had a wind mitigation certificate i could input that info in here it does want units in fire division we'll clear this out for now and even though, and I would just highlight that this is the quick quote, right? This is where you would put the wind mitigation in if, you, if we had one. Okay. Now there's no more where I can put in, so I'm going to click premium estimate. And hopefully um, we're getting closer. Go over here. Uh, it's saying the roof covers now. Okay. So it's it's giving me a hard time because nothing has been filled in on the wind mitigation. So for now, I'm going to just fill in some basic things here. Most people in Florida do have a wind mitigation at some level, so that's not that uncommon. <clears throat> Once we do that, say, Lord have mercy, please, <laughs> roof cover. Okay, I think we're getting pretty close. And there we go. Bam. Okay. So now keep in mind, and I'm obviously talking through it, but we did that in less than 10 minutes. Okay. So now it's giving me a basic option. I can click print estimate and now I've got something I can share with my client. Now keep in mind to ultimately go through and do citizens and bind it, we would have to go through the clearinghouse and that will probably shoot on a separate video. If you have questions, let me know. As always, dream big and make it happen.